Hello artist, this is Art with Ms. LaGrange, and today we are going to be creating chameleon. And chameleons are very unique, and we've talked a bit about how they change color to camouflage themselves against a predator, or perhaps they just change their color because of a mood. So interestingly, we are going to be creating a colorful chameleon but we need to start drawing the shape of the chameleon first. And so we are going to be breaking it down into simple steps so we are able to create a beautiful chameleon. So I'm going to leave a picture of the chameleon on the screen so you can really take a close look at what it looks like before you start drawing. So boys and girls, again, let's take a look at these beautiful chameleons and see the details on their bodies. And also look really closely at the parts of the chameleon. We had mentioned that the chameleon has eyes that can see in all different directions. We also said that they change color quite a bit. Here's a chameleon that hasn't changed color, but it's really gonna let us look at the details on the feet and the tail. And remember, we can also include that tongue. So to create, we are going to need a pencil and colored construction paper. And first I'm sketching the body of the chameleon. It looks like a large oval. I'm gonna leave the end open so I can squeeze in the head. And to begin with, I have the head starting off like a triangle that's upside down. And then below on the chin of the chameleon, it has a bumpy chin. So I've added that in the eye. And now I love working on the swirl of the tail. And I'm going to erase that area in between that I had on my body. And I'm also going to erase the area where the legs will be. So I'm adding a hot dog shape. And then if you notice the feet spread open and they have two claws on the bottom and three on the top. And I'll add the back legs as well. And now let's add the tongue to our beautiful chameleon. Boys and girls, one thing I forgot to mention is to make sure that your chameleon touches all four sides of your paper. So you can see my tongue is just hitting this other side of the paper. I've touched the top, the bottom, and the two sides. Next time we will add color to our chameleon because you know chameleons have all different types of beautiful colors. See you then.